Uh, one of the most important things of having uh, to carry out research is having a research vessel. And many countries uh, in, in, in Africa do not have these uh, facilities like, uh, like Mirabolus that we have a huge multidisciplinary research vessel. So and as a government institute, a research institute that is tasked with carrying out monitoring and research, having a research vessel of this uh, nature is, it is a huge privilege. So, and for our work, uh, it, it is absolutely indispensable. Shipboard monitoring, for instance, uh, it's in, uh, you cannot do away with it. You need to have a research vessel to be able to carry out these sort of uh, activities. For fishery surveys, you need to have a research vessel. So for Mirabilis, to have such a huge uh, investment in terms of the infrastructure, in terms of Mirabilis, then for a country like Namibia, it is a huge, huge achievement. Of course, the question is, how should we use it? And the best way to use it, and what the output should be. So it's a huge responsibility that is on us as scientists now to use this uh, vessel to, to be the most effective um, way. On the other hand also, we cannot do this work without, uh, for instance, the collaboration with the Finnish uh, Research Institute and the scientists uh, that uh, we collaborate with through this uh, Mirabless project. It was a huge, huge uh, uh, investment in terms of resources, in terms of time from the other scientists. And as a young scientist, I personally feel very privileged to learn from very experienced researchers that we collaborated with. And one could not ask for more to work under with these scientists. Uh, and I had, we had wonderful memories. And hope, I hope in the future this sort of collaboration still continues. And uh, yeah, I mean, we are very privileged. And I'm happy to have such a huge research vessel. And I hope we can improve the capacity of our research output internationally and have more international scientists come to Namibia and study with us our system.